Well, the biggest names in Australian film and TV have gathered on the Gold Coast last night for the Actor Awards. Yeah, that's right. The Sunshine State didn't quite live up to its name. There was pouring rain and high humidity, but it certainly didn't stop the stars from celebrating. Today's Ashlyn Krukelis was there for us on the red carpet. You're so golden. This is it, the Australian Academy of Cinema and Television Arts Awards, the actors for short, affectionately known as the Aussie Oscars. This show is usually held in Sydney, but this year, for the first time ever, the industry's finest have come together on the Gold Coast. Marco, welcome home. You look more glittering than the Gold Coast. <laughs> I know, with the rain, definitely. You're here to accept the prestigious Trailblazer Award. How does it feel to be honoured by the local industry? It's really amazing. And the fact that they're holding the hosting the awards on the Gold Coast is just, it feels like it was all meant to be this year. I did have big, big dreams as a kid. And big dreams can carry you pretty far, but the love and support of your family and friends will carry you much further. How are you feeling about the Oscars nomination? Oh my gosh, yeah, we've got the we've got the nominees luncheon on Monday in LA, so that will be very very special. And um, I've never, yeah, been nominated as a producer before, which feels like a huge step in my career, and I'm okay. thrilled about that. I know we are matching. I know we got the memo. How are you feeling about the actors being on the Gold Coast? Hey, it is so lovely. The only thing I'm not sure about is the humidity. Um, but the but the best part about wigs is it's hard as a bloody rock. Look, that's not going to go frizzy. <laughs> It's raining, it's hot, it's humid. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Why is it important that we all get together to celebrate the industry? I think to remind ourselves, you know, it's a very complicated time to be making films, to be releasing them. I think there's a lot of fear. And tonight is about courage and celebration of risk taking that has paid off. Middle aged Barbie. <laughs> here family night out i know it's yeah. funny usually it's claudia taking us on the yeah. red carpet we're the parents and this, this year. year we're the parents how proud are you guys of bump and all it's achieved so far we are beyond words proud of bump it's been such a blessing for us and the fact yeah. that the australia enjoys it the way um they do is just it's really special it's important that we show as many of our stories and the diversity of our creators the talent that we should all be proud of when it comes to the Australian film and television industry. So, you know, and it's a chance to bloody get dressed up and look a little bit fine. It's vitally important that we keep telling our Australian stories. We need to, as a nation, to understand our identity. It was such a special project. The moment I, I read it, I became kind of obsessed with it. And, you know, you always hope to make something and for it to succeed, and not everything always does. So for this to really work, I was like, Ecstatic. Is it busy enough for you? Nah, make it busier. More people, squish it in. I'm not hot enough. And make it rain more. Yeah, it's yeah, good yeah. good for the hair. I love it. I actually love being like humid and sweaty. I grew up here. It's like, I got off the plane and I was like, ah, nice. I have lots of BO. <laughs> it's perfect. I'm very excited. I'm very excited to be here with friends, my husband, and just to look at all the fancy people and be in. I mean, look excellent, but very uncomfortable. You but, look amazing, um, but it is a bit like that, isn't it? It is a bit like that. And you've won an actor before for season one. What would it mean to win it again? <laughs> oh, I, I mean, a lot. It looked, to be honest, you, when you're on a show that's got 15 nominations, it's sort of like, I feel like we've won already. Talk to me nominated for best film. How's it going to go? We're going to lose, but we're going to throw a glass. We've been practicing our salty face if we lose awards. We're going to be like this. We were able to do it our way, the Aussie way, and it was the best decision we ever made. Now we're bringing Hollywood here. Yeah, we want to stay in Adelaide, South Australia, South Australia. We're up in Adelaide. Is this Adelaide? What do you think of Australia's version of Hollywood, the Gold Coast? I mean, it's it's fantastic. You know, the, the, the people are, this is the real deal. Like anybody who knows cinema, knows music, knows scoring, knows that this is an incredible pool of talent. That's why they take it so seriously around the world. Ashton Krukelis, best dressed on the red carpet, Always. in my opinion. Hey there, Today fans. Sarah and... <laughs>
Okay. What's my name again? Oh my God. Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports, and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?